Brianna, can I hold your hand? Uh, that's a little weird to me because we're not married yet, but okay. <laughs> You got shocked when you touched Timmy because he isn't your soulmate. When you touch someone who's not your soulmate, you get shocked. But if you touch your soulmate, magical sparks will fly. You're not my soulmate, Timmy. Get away from me. And you're stinky. But I love you. My love. Babe. Ouch, 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 ouch. 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 Babe, could I kiss you? Uh, yeah. Ow. That wasn't too bad. Babe. I can't do this anymore. You're not my soulmate, and I don't see sparks when I touch you. I just keep getting shocked, and it really hurts. Who cares if we're not soulmates? I love you. I love you too, but I can't be with you. <laughs> oh no, I really gotta get out of here. Hey, hey, wait. Oh no, I really gotta get out of here. Hey. Hey, wait! Stop running from me! You're my soulmate! I'm really out of shape. Brianna, is everything okay? My soulmate just ran away from me. Maybe I've seen him. What does he look like? He had on a black ski mask, so I couldn't see his face. And he was carrying a giant bag over his shoulder. Oh, and he was running away from me. He sounds like such a weirdo. Hey, baby. Hi, Jakey. I missed you so much. Jake, Brittany, why are you two holding hands? Because we're soulmates. When I was walking in the hallway, I noticed that Brittany dropped her book. I went to help her pick it up, and we accidentally touched hands, and magical sparks flew. Isn't it great? My ex and my best friends are soulmates. Great. It's not like we just broke up or anything. Bree, are you upset? No, no, it's really, it's great. It's great. Great. Class, has anyone seen a guy wearing a ski mask, carrying a bag over his shoulder? Yes, I saw him. That's my soul. Great, because the police are looking for him. I mean, not. I didn't see him anywhere. Freeze tag. Help. Help! Unfreeze me! Please! <laughs> teacher! Teacher! Unfreeze. Derek, that game is very dangerous. It's only used to kill people. You know the rules. You play freeze tag and you're expelled. Attention everyone, you will no longer be expelled for playing freeze tag. In fact, the government encourages it and you will receive a cash reward if you play. This can't be real. That's awful. Who would play that game? Freeze tag! Help me, I'm frozen! Unfreeze. Derek, don't do that! Did you hear what Derek did? No. What'd he do? He's running around the school playing freeze tag. He's killed two people already. And the worst part is, he received money for those he killed. Let's run this way. Derek's coming. <laughs> Hello, ladies. Freeze tag, Derek. No! Unfreeze me! Freeze tag. Bestie, why did you just freeze me? Freeze tag. Bestie, why did you just freeze me? Unfreeze. Hurry, unfreeze me too! Oh no, it's too late! <laughs> Seriously? Freezing your own best friend? Why would you do that? I'm so sorry. Sorry that you tried to kill me? Things are bad at home right now. I really needed the prize money. I wasn't thinking. What you did was unforgivable. Don't talk to me anymore. Hey, you killed my boyfriend! Who? Derek? I think I did you a favor. Freeze tag. You're gonna get what you deserve. No! Unfreeze. Jake! Freeze tag. No, unfreeze me! She's the one who killed Derek! Let's get out of here. This school's gone crazy. I know, it's getting really dangerous around here. Hey, you and I should maybe team up. Freeze tag. No, please unfreeze me! Now that you and I are a team, I won't let anybody hurt you. Me too. Somebody help me! It's really dangerous around here. Follow me. Let's go this way. Yeah. Here, take my hand. Here you go. This is your gown. Before you enter the class, you must put this on. What are these? These gowns will be used to keep you safe while you're in class. While you have them on, no one will be able to tag you. Now remember everyone, these gowns are only used to keep you safe while you're in class so you can learn. Once class is over, you must dispose of them immediately. This place is getting insane. It's not fair they make us take off those gowns. Freeze tag. Jake! Unfreeze. Freeze tag. Bessie, why'd you freeze me? You froze Jake. I'm sorry, I didn't know you two were friends. You're not going to let me die, right? I'm your best friend. Freeze tag. Bestie, why'd you freeze me? You froze Jake. I'm sorry, I didn't know you two were friends. You're not going to let me die, right? You're my best friend. <laughs> hey, are you okay? I can't believe I just let my best friend die. 
What have I become? Haha, <laughs> <laughs> freeze tag! No! Come on, we have to go. It's not safe here. You're always looking out for me, Jake. Yeah, I am. Do you remember Derek? Yeah, he was the worst. I'm glad I froze him. He was my best friend. What? Yeah, since preschool. Freeze tag. When Derek's girlfriend froze you, I knew I had to save you because I'm the one who should get revenge from my best friend. I'm not frozen, Jake. What? How? The gown. These gowns will be used to keep you safe while you're in class. Will you have them on? No one can tag you. Uh-oh, you got a mark. Five mistakes and you're out. Out? Like... Yes, exactly. Two plus two. Brianna, what's the answer? Um... I can't answer it. I don't want to make a mistake. I know the answer. It's three. <laughs> that was Timmy's fifth mistake. Five mistakes and you're out. Brianna, hold this. What is wrong with you? Why did you give that to me to hold when I wasn't ready? Chill out. It's no big deal. No, I can't chill out. I have two marks now. Three more and I'm out. Giving her that to hold was a mistake. What? How is that a mistake? Was it a mistake? Brianna, if you agree, I'll take away one of your marks. Was it a mistake? Brianna, if you agree, I'll take away one of your marks. Um. No, that's my last mistake. You still have three left. It was her mistake, not mine. Hey, guys. You can't sit with us. Why not? The reason Sophie's dead. You let her die so you didn't get another mark. Why should I get a mark? I wasn't the one who made a mistake. Five marks and you're out. You're so selfish. Your shoelaces are untied. Hmm? Why would you do that? Sir, she made a mistake. She forgot to tie her shoelaces and then she tripped. What? No, you tripped me. You're now the school's target. That's what you get for killing Sophie. You're going to be next. I wonder what's in mommy's purse. Chicken nugget. Brianna, did you steal my purse? I really hope you're telling the truth, because if you don't tell the truth before the timer runs out, you'll die. Okay, I took it. I'm glad you told the truth. Now remember, never lie, because it's very dangerous, okay? Okay. Brianna, has Jake came to school yet? Uh, my boyfriend Jake? No, I haven't seen him yet. Hey, baby. Jakey! Are we still on for our date tonight? Of course. <laughs> Jake, you were so funny. Huh? It's just like, you could get any girl in the world, and you trust Brianna. <laughs> um, anyways, I gotta go. I'll see you later, babe. Okay, bye, Jakey. Hey, Emma. Do you have a crush on my boyfriend? Because you were acting like a total pick-me when he was around. What? No way. Why would I like your boyfriend? Are you sure you're telling the truth? Honestly? What? No, why would I like your boyfriend? Are you sure you're telling the truth? Honestly, yeah, I do have a crush on Jake. But there's something else you should know. Jake and I were dating behind your back a few months ago. I'm sorry, Brianna. No, no, Emma, you're lying. He would never do that. If I was lying, I would die. Go ask Jake yourself if you don't believe me. Got your pen. Jakey. <laughs> Jake, Emma told me earlier that you guys used to date while dating me. Is that true? It's Brianna and Jake. Did you already finish your assignments? Yep. Yes, sir. It's true. Emma and I were seeing each other while you and I were dating. But I don't love Emma. I've always loved you. I don't love you and I never have, Jake. Brianna. I'm in love with Jake and I always have been. Was that Jake? Continue being a doll or become a human. I've always wanted to be a human. Oh, honey, you're awake. I just started making breakfast. Here, you should have something to drink. You must be thirsty. Refreshing. Thank you. Um, darling, the water's actually supposed to go in your mouth. Sorry, it's my first day being a human. Brianna, there you are. Brianna? What's a Brianna? Um, you. That's your name. Well, I used to be a doll. Babe, I've missed you so much. Come here. Why would you do that? Because we're boyfriend and girlfriend. That's what we do. 
Hey, are you actually a doll or were you a doll? Mm -hmm. Yes. Then that means you've stolen the real Brianna's body. The real Brianna must be trapped in a doll somewhere. Please, please listen to me. I am not a doll. I am a human trapped inside a doll. This doll so advanced, who programmed her? I wasn't programmed. I'm human. I need to get out of here. <laughs> You're not going to get very far with plastic legs. This doll's kind of weird. Do you think any kids will buy a human trapped in a doll doll? I don't think so, boss. That's not very popular amongst kids. I told you, I am not a doll. Yeah, I don't think she'll sell. If no one buys her by the end of the day, we'll throw her in the garbage. Wow, I want this doll. She looks so realistic. Little girl, I am not a doll. I am a human. You've stolen the real Brianna's body. The real Brianna must be trapped in a doll somewhere. Do you know where you used to live when you were a doll? That must be where the real Brianna is. I used to live in a room with lots of other dolls where little kids would come and stare at us. Oh, a toy store. Babe, you look so beautiful today. <laughs> Stop it, Jake. That's not the real Brianna. Okay, but it still looks like her. Why does my face feel so warm? Because you're blushing. Now, come on. We have to find out which toy store you're from. You were Brianna's best friend? Not were. I am Brianna's best friend. I've never had a friend before. My eyes are feeling wet. That's because you're about to cry. Cry? Okay, this is a toy store. Do you recognize it? Yes, this used to be my home. I want to leave. Hello, ladies. Could I help you find anything? Why does your friend look so scared? She's just like that. Do you have a doll that's like super realistic? Kind of seems like a human. Yeah, a little girl just stole her. <laughs> Thank you for saying that to me. It really helped me understand. I'm sorry, I want to buy you, but I don't have any money. You don't need any money. You just need to carry me and run. You're pretty heavy. Thank you for getting me out of there. Now I'll show you where the best place to find me is. My high school. Okay, you show me the way and I'll carry you. Wait, before we go, I must ask. Won't your parents be worried about you? My parents won't be worried about me because I don't have any parents. I'm an orphan. I don't have any friends either. That's why I wanted a doll so bad, so I could have someone to play with and keep me company. I'll make you a deal. Once you get me back in my human body, I'll buy you as many dolls as you would like. Who are you looking at? My best friend Stephanie! And me! What are we going to do now? A little girl stole the real Brianna! Hey, look over there! That's me! Come on, hurry! Let's catch up to them! Brianna, wait! Stephanie! And me! Me when I was a doll. We found the real Brianna, but how are we going to get your body switched back? I have an option to go back as a doll, but I'm sorry, I can't do it. I don't want to go back to that toy store and that bad man. No, you have to give Brianna's body back. You're a doll, and she's a human. You can't steal her body. I have an idea. If you choose to go back as a doll, you can come back with me and be my doll. We'll be best friends. A friend? I've never had a friend before. Okay, I'll choose it. I'm back in my body. I'm back as a doll. Stephanie, I've missed you so much. I'm so excited to bring you home with me. Yes, you and I are going to have so much fun. <laughs> Yay! What is this? Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday, seven days a week? Oh no, Grandma, you have to say the name of the song and the artist or else... <laughs> I don't know it! I'll give you a hint. It's a Korean artist. I don't listen to K-pop. That wasn't in my generation. It's in English! The title is literally in the lyrics! Friday by Rebecca Black. <laughs> no, Grandma! It was Seven by Jungkook! What happened to Grandma? Is she sleeping? Come on, Emily. We're going to be late for school. I'm super shy, super shy, but wait a minute while I make you mine? You just gotta name that song. I did. Give me a hint. The lyrics are, I'm super shy, super shy. Yes. Song name, super shy. Yes. Uh-oh, I don't know the artist's name. Pants, pants, what material are my pants? Jeans? The artist is new jeans. Emily, you got it. You're safe. Yay. La, 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 lunch. What the fuck? La, 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 lunch. What the fuck? Hurry, answer it. I don't know this song, Emily. 
It's from the movie we watched together. You know the cartoon with the orange fluffy guy? How bad can I be by Ed Helms? I got it! Yay! Come on, Sissy, let's go to school. How, How bad, bad I, 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 I can I be? Hey, Brianna, you look so beautiful today. Aw, thank you, Jason. You're so sweet. You're like a brother to me. Oh, no. I just got to name that song. The lyrics are, where I see love, she sees a friend. Jason, I'll give you a hint. It's from the Barbie movie. Song name, I'm just Ken. I'm just Ken. Where I see love, she sees a friend. What will it take for her? Wow, you're really into that song, Jason. I'm just Ken sung by Michael Sarah. No, Jason, it was by Ryan Gosling. Brianna, they need you at your sister's school. Something happened to Emily. Brianna, they need you at your sister's school. Something happened to Emily. I just got to name that song. Pop, 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 uh, uh. The song name is in the lyrics. It's a song sung by one of the members of Twice. Pop by Nyong. Pop, pop, pop. Brianna, your sister. Right. Where's my sister? Is she okay? We can't find her. What do you mean you can't find her? We've looked everywhere. We tried to contact your mother multiple times, but there was no answer. I have to go find her. I just got to name that song. Could you please give me a hint? Okay, but hurry. Read me the lyrics now. Seeing you tonight, it's a bad idea, right? The song name is literally in the lyrics. Bad idea, right, by Taylor Swift? No! Come on, Mom. Pick up the phone. Sissy. Emily, what happened to you? I found out who's running the game. I need your help. Can you give me a foot massage? Oh, no. Grandma, I really wish I could, but I really got to get to school. Oh, no. I am always on the dinner table, but you don't get to eat me. What am I? Grandma, you have three tries to guess it right, or else... This is an easy one. Feet. No, Grandma, your feet should never be on the table. My dad drew. No, Grandma, it's something you put food on. My hand. Thank goodness she's gone. She was giving me a headache. Grandpa! How could you say that about Grandma? I live in the ocean. I can live for a very long time. I'm a very large mammal. What am I? A large mammal? That's your Grandma! Grandpa! <laughs> a dolphin? A shark? A whale? I got it. You sure it wasn't your Grandma? <laughs> Grandpa! I have two hands, but I cannot scratch myself. What am I? <laughs> your Grandmother! Mommy, why whenever I hold onto an object, it says send to soulmate? That's because, honey, any object you touch, you can send to your soulmate, and he can send you any object he touches. I'm going to send him Mr. Octopus. <gasps> Mommy, my soulmate wants to send me something. What is it you know, my octopus? And why is there a puzzle piece with an H on it? Oh, honey. I'm never letting my soulmate send me anything ever again. And I'm never sending him anything. My soulmate sent me flowers. Oh, that's so sweet. Did your soulmate send you anything today? No, I haven't accepted anything from my soulmate since I was six. You should accept it. It might be something important. Yeah. A puzzle piece with an E on it. Oh, my soulmate's trying to send me something again. LP? He sent me E earlier. Maybe he's trying to say something? Yeah, like Lep or Elp, pal. And why is there a puzzle piece with an H on it? Help! Help! My soulmate was trying to say that he needs help. What am I going to do? You should send him over something so he can protect himself. Good idea. Here, send him this frying pan. Now you're talking. My soulmate's trying to send me something. He sent me the frying pan back. He must not need it. Brianna, look, he attached something. It's a puzzle piece with a one on it. I wonder what this one could mean. My soulmate's trying to send me something. Four, three. Maybe he's trying to tell me what address he's at? Or maybe it's a code to unlock something? Sophie, I'm worried about my soulmate. He hasn't sent me anything in hours. What if something happened to him? Here, send him this. Oh, moldy cheese? It smells so bad that if someone's holding him captive, they'll release him for sure. Why do you have this on hand? You don't? Maybe I can send over myself. I don't know. I don't think you're considered an object. I can send myself, but I'm scared. I don't know where I'm going to end up. It's not a good idea. It's too dangerous. Please, don't go. My soulmate wants to send me something. 
A six. He wants to send me something again. What is it? It's an arrow, but I can't tell if it's up or down. Attach it to the puzzle piece and see. It's down. He sent me dirt. This is getting weird. I need to go to him. Brianna, wait. Take this for protection. Promise me you'll come back safely. I promise I will. Why am I at a graveyard? Six down. I think he was trying to say he's six feet under. Help! Help me! Are you still alive? The leader for today. Everyone, they're choosing the leader for today. I hope it's me. <laughs> it's me. That means you all have to follow what I do or you die. Timmy, you'll be a good leader, right? You won't make anyone do anything terrible. <laughs> Begin your exam. Oh, I don't want to write my exam. Everyone, take your exam paper, crumple it up, and throw it in the garbage. But no, no, I need straight A's. I have to write this exam. Eugene, you have to follow whatever the leader does or you'll die. No, I have to get into Harvard. I have to write... Everyone stop. We're doing 100 jumping jacks. Timmy, why? One. Two. One hundred. Timmy, that was a lot of jumping jacks. Maybe we should all drink water. No, there's no time for that. We're going to rob a bank. They're changing the leader. One hundred. Timmy, that was a lot of jumping jacks. Maybe we should all drink water. No, there's no time for that. We're going to rob a bank. They're changing the leader. The new leader. No way. I'm the new leader. Everyone, let's touch the top of the lockers. Kayla, no! You know I'm too short to reach the top of a locker. Exactly, Timmy. You're the reason Eugene's dead. He was the love of my life. Now this is what you get. Kayla, no! Everyone, we can all put our arms down now. Now who am I going to get revenge on next? I know you're hurt, but another person dying isn't going to take away your pain. Looks like you're next, Brianna. Everyone, we're going to cut off a chunk of our hair. What? No, I love my hair! You must do as the leader does. Everyone, we're going to cut off a chunk of our hair. What? No, I love my hair! You must do as the leader does. Wait. I'm going to choose a piece from the back. Hurry up! Okay! <laughs> I really didn't think you'd actually do it, Brianna. They're changing the leader! The new leader. No! It's me. So, leader, what are we doing now? Right, I'm the leader. Okay, everyone, we're going to drink some Perrier water, and then we're going to have lunch. Everyone, for lunch, we are eating a peanut butter wrap. Brianna, no! I'm deathly allergic to peanuts! Kayla, you have to do as the leader does or they'll kill you. But if I eat peanut butter, I'll die. You have to try. I go and I return the shirt. Mm -hmm. I just made $60. Girl math. Girl math. Oh, yeah. You want to throw things at Timmy? Yeah. No, you can't throw things at Timmy. You're no fun, Susan. The last time you threw things at Timmy, he ended up in the hospital. Oh, oh, it's okay. I'll get it. I'll get it. Oh! Oh, my back! My back! Ladies, it's time to take your pain medicine. We're not taking our medicine, Susan! No! Boo! Oh, tomato! Tomato! Boo. Oh no, she only has one brain cell today. That's not enough. How is she going to survive? <laughs> Here, honey, eat this. It's breakfast. Cut. She can't go through the day with only one brain cell. I know what to do. I was gifted a special chocolate that increases brain cells. Honey, eat this right away. Kitchen. No, sweetie, that's chocolate. You need to eat it. So close, sweetie, but a bit lower. Yes. And take a bite. The mitochondria is the powerhouse of the cell. I just read that entire book in three seconds. Honey, she has infinite brain cells. All right, guardians, I'm off to school. No need to walk me. I know the way. Class, what's three plus two? The answer's five, miss. What is this, baby class? Are we in baby school? This is kindergarten, but you're too smart for kindergarten. You'll have to go to high school. 